Uh, my dog was just making weird noises. She was like, it was so weird. Also, Snowmageddon is hitting, so brace yourselves. Hey everybody, what's up? My name is Sydney. Welcome back to my channel. My recent tour of the internet, because this happens frequently, where you end up in like this super massive internet black hole, and you just, you start on cat videos, and you end on like weird beauty tutorials and you're just like ha like how how did I even get here that's probably how you got here too to be honest it's called photofeeler.com so basically you upload your photos and you can choose between um, social dating and professional to upload and then uh, depending upon which of those three categories you upload it gives you like rankings like people rank your photos of like no yes and very um, for category, like three categories per category, subcategories, but this is confusing. Categorizes you into like, your age and your gender. Uh, the results were a little bit strange, <laughs> to say the least, so, um, yeah, but they were kind of interesting, so I thought I'd share them with you guys. They're just a general rule, like, I tried to get about 30 votes per picture. So some of them have 30, some of them have a little bit less, but they're all between 25 and 30. One. 31 is the highest so we're all we're all good people can also put comments down on your photos so those are really fun to look at <laughs> for the one for my glasses I got 78% I'm only 75% trustworthy in that photo and then I was 74% attractive so at least I at least I had some consistency across the board oh this is great somebody said great photo I think they seem a bit uncomfortable in this photo I what what? And then someone else said, I would date them. Where are you? Somebody else said, smile seems forced and I would suggest relax your eyes. So I was like, my eyes are relaxed. But then I looked at the photo and I was like, oh yeah, I do look a little bit like crazy eyes here. Someone else said, I would prefer it with different clothing. What? I thought for sure that a black sweater would be like literally the most generic item of clothing ever. But apparently not. I don't understand, but okay and then someone else said would prefer if it didn't seem like a selfie well okay I don't have a professional camera crew following me around I don't have a photographer being like oh the lighting the lighting you pretend like you're so candid like oh oh my gosh ah. I'm gonna knock stuff off the wall I'm getting too into this this is what I have to work with people it's just me so then my next photo I decided well I had done curly hair and glasses so let's let's do straight hair no glasses so people thought I was 79% smart so I was a little bit smarter in this photo 84% trustworthy so I'm moving on up in the world 90% attractive I'm sorry my face doesn't look like that not not 90% attractive like no no thanks somebody said great smile and then somebody else said great smile and I'm like ah cool I'll tell my dad that you said that because He's always harassing me about paying for my braces and then never seeing me smile. Somebody else said, would prefer if it didn't seem like a selfie. Okay, I see where you're coming from. Again, don't have a photographer on hand. Thank you very much. Somebody said, seems a bit too close up. Would prefer if it weren't cropped as tightly. Well, if we're all being honest here, I cropped it tightly <laughs> to crop out my arms. People say, oh, Oh, you have such a pretty face, and then they see the rest of my body, and they're like, ah, maybe not so much. Somebody said, great photo, thank you. Somebody else said, I would date them, where are you, again? <laughs> then I decided, okay, well, I've had two close-up photos, and people have said twice about me having them too close up, so I was like, fine, y'all want to see the rest of my body? Here's the rest of my body. So this said, I was 71% attractive. Uh, about right, just right right on hit the nail on the head with that one and then <laughs> they said I was 99% trustworthy um okay so moral of the story is people feel like they can trust you if you're non-threatening with a disability that is exactly what that means and this thing literally says top 2% with an exclamation mark like okay and then Somebody said, great smile, great smile. Oh, thanks, I'll send you my orthodontist bill. And then somebody said, gorgeous face, would date. Aw, oh, thank you. So then, my last one, I decided to take the photo that I had uploaded um, with the straight hair, no glasses, and a filter, and upload it again, but without the filter. This one only got 22 votes. I tried to up the vote number before I filmed this, but 
again with the low votes and the low karma it wasn't working so 22 votes is where we're sitting at attractive 87 percent so i was like wow wow um okay who knows what i could do with eight more votes you know who knows who knows it could tip the scale the world could change also i could get more ugly but we'll just disregard that fact trustworthy 89 percent i don't know what it is about my face in this picture that people think i'm trustworthy but hey and then smart 90 percent 90 percent what Oh, people, I got mixed reviews on my comments. Great smile. And then um, somebody else said I would date them. Okay, again, for the third time, where are you? I'm getting a little bit tired of repeating myself here. And somebody else said seems a bit too close up, which is not a surprise because somebody else said that on the first one of that that I uploaded with the filter on it. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it was way different than anything that I normally do, but I've been obsessed with this all week. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you're a subscriber, thanks for coming back. If you're not, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell to make sure that you know when I upload because sometimes YouTube decides to not include me on that list. And I get really frustrated when people do that because how are you supposed to know when this awesomeness shows up in your subscription box unless you're notified? I don't freaking know! I guess I'll see you guys next week. Bye guys! I think I'm spitting everywhere. I don't know what's happening. It's Snowmageddon. <laughs> so you know what? What's more appropriate than me at the state fear? 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 State fear? If you're eating a bag of mini donuts, <laughs> nothing, nothing is more me than that. Um, I'm really smoking that thing, aren't I? Wow. Okay. Hair probs. Hair probs. Who, 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 who. Can you tell I've been cramped up all day? It's great. I also had McDonald's for lunch, so I'm a little bit hyped up on french fries and nuggets right now, so bear with me. Also, my shirt says Barcelona because I went to Spain, but I went to Madrid, so I don't really know why I have this shirt.